like opening day for Revenge of the Sith all over again. Just, you know, minus the stormtroopers. My mom thinks I should donate. She says my blood is special. I think it's exactly why I should keep it where it belongs. In my veins. Dude, she has to say your blood is special. She's your mom. Anyway, the reason you don't give blood is because you're too scared of needles, you big chicken. I'm not afraid. I just don't like them. All right, the same way you don't like the commercial with the dancing crackers. It freaks you out. It does not. Okay, I'm just uncomfortable with eating things that dance. Plus, I don't see you rushing to donate. Uh, yeah. They can lift your entire genetic code from one drop. But what if someone cloned me? No way. Oh, my. my. Oh, my. Then again, I could stand to lose a pint or two. You know what I'm saying? Come on. Unless, of course, you're too chicken. I'm not a chicken. I'm a hawk with huge talons and laser eyes. I just have to talk to Sarah about something. Fine. More nurse time for me, then. Hey, Sarah. What's up? Not much. You OK? Why? Don't I look okay? You have, like, half a bag of chips on your face. Fine. Seeing all this blood is really getting to you, huh? It's like letting contestants from The Biggest Loser lose in a chocolate factory. Do you need help? I could be, like, your diet buddy. It's Erica I'm worried about. She doesn't have much self-control in it. Hey, sir. Cookie. The sooner we get past this whole awkward phase of our friendship, the better. I don't eat humans. Sorry, that's awkward for you. What's the deal with Sarah? It's the smell. She's scarping junk food to dull the craving. Mortal food's not gonna satisfy her hunger. It's like Vampire 101. You better keep an eye on her. And our other fanged friends as well. Dude, if anything bad happens, we must rescue the nurses. I am saving that one. Called it. <sighs> oh, I've got to get me one of those. Hey, you're a big, strong guy. You've got one more pint for me? Annie, keep the line moving. I'm off to the truck. Truck? Full of blood? Is it vampire Christmas already? Oh, could be risky. I need a gullible little monkey to steal it from me. Oh, baby! A blood vending machine! Sweet! How would you like to go on a secret mission? Here's the plan. They're up to something. I'm gonna try to get closer. Well played, young Padawan. Well played. No, no, no! Don't do this to me! You do realize you could end your pain with one teensy little sip? That 
blood is meant to save lives, you know. Well, duh, mission accomplished. <sighs> see? No screaming. Right, until you get caught. We'll see who screams then. Oh, no problem. Five second rule. I am strong enough to fight this craving. After I eat this chip. You're not actually thinking of coming back, are you? Because I seriously doubt you could top that faint. Did Spock give up when he watched Vulcan sucked out of existence by a single drop of red matter? Sorry, dude. You're on your own. Later. <sighs> Sarah. Hey, you're doing okay with the whole... Don't say it. So, uh, if you're done for the day, let's say we grab a quick zap. I'm just here for the blood. Fine. I'll just... I'll just bleed then. <laughs> now you're getting it, sweetie. <laughs> tell you anything. Erica would kill me. Though I already said too much. <laughs> Not cool. What's up with Count Dorfula? Sounds like Erica's pulling his strings. Oh, so she's the puppet master. I'll bet they're after the blood. Mmm, the crimson nectar. Time to call in the big gun. <laughs> if you mean Sarah, she's got enough on her plate today. It's time you and I got our hands dirty. Good thing I brought hand sanitizer. You were speaking metaphorically, were you? Gotcha. Hey, Jude, I told you, lips sealed. It's not that. I just have a quick question. If you can be anyone for one day, who would it be? Thor or the Hulk? Thor is a Norse god with a magic hammer that can summon lightning from the heavens. The Hulk is a big green goofus with purple short shorts. Next time, at least try to make it challenging. Muchos gracias, amigo. Say what? GPS is in place. We can now track Roy's position at all times. Well, never thought I'd say this, but let's spend the day following Rory around. <laughs> Do you have a plan for the truck? Yep. And it's tight, see? The spaceship is the blood truck. I'm the mini marshmallow. You're the red cinnamon heart. Because you're red hot. <laughs> so, you wait over here out of sight while I attack the truck and remove anyone crazy enough to get in my way. <laughs> <clears throat> but, you know, I won't get mooshed up like that. We get in and take off with the blood. Great. That is fine. Do you have my laundry? Hex, yeah. Cleaned and pressed. <laughs> You're the best. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> oh, so soft. Surveillance music. Spying on you. Benny, knock it off. What? He's just doing our laundry. Looks like it. But. Why was he showing her that model spaceship? Oh, gee, I don't know. How many times has he brought toys over to your place? You're right. Mm-hmm. Anyways, clinic's closing. I think our work here is done. You want to come over and play robo-zombie? I used the cheat code to unlock a new brain grenade. Uh, uh... What? We can still monitor his GPS signal from there. Deal. We've earned it. <laughs> uh, you go ahead. I'll catch up, okay? Hey, Sarah, hold up. Hey, Ethan, sorry I've been a bit moody today. Oh, no, I, I totally get it. But you'll be happy to know that Benny and I held down the fort while you were gone. The blood is safe. But at what cost? Maybe we should have just let Erica have it. I mean, better blood bags than body bags, right? Wow. I guess that follows a certain vampire logic. You okay? Yeah, kinda. Nothing a dozen powdered donuts won't cure. Or 
You heading out? Um. No. I have to see a nurse about a chicken. Now's your chance. Go. You got it, hot stuff. Don't call me that. Good idea. Switching to alternate code names. Sweet cheeks. <sighs> last call, but I got a pint of blood just sloshing around inside me. If, if you wanted, I promise I won't faint. Come on. What is taking so long? Uh, uh, uh. Hello, Earth to Moron. What are you doing behind the school, Rory? It's in the security camera, I to say. Uh. <laughs> hey, what gives? That's my blood. I was, uh, just making sure it was good enough for your lips, my sweet. What's going on here? Back off, sweetie, or these blood bags won't be the only things getting drained. <laughs> Not exactly the reaction I was going for. Before you do it, could you give me, like, a three count? No, no, five. Five count would be great. Benny, dude, Rory and Erica are gonna hit the donor van behind the school. This won't hurt a bit. Relax. I don't bite. Promise? You're a nurse, so you know what these little babies can do to a jugular. Oh. Wait till you see what happens when those babies are all grown up. She's one of us? Oh. I did not expect that. No. You have broken one of our oldest laws. Trying to steal food from your own kind? The council will make sure you pay for this. Like a vampire fine? Just give the ticket to Pasty Face here. I'm sure he's huh? good for it. Not me. Hey! What? Hey, what is that? How much blood do you take? How much do you have? <laughs> Just a pint. <sighs> Annie, we're leaving. Now. Maybe next time. It's a shame, too. You smell. Hmm. Interesting. Annie, let's go. You can uh, help yourself to a cookie on the way out. Ethan? Okay, we've got big trouble. <laughs> Those nurses? They're vampires. I just had a vision. What is that smell? It's amazing. You said your blood? It smells so good, like, really, really good. Thanks. Uh, here, <laughs> have a cookie. I'll take two. <laughs> what, seriously? I ran for nothing. Yeah. Benny? Ethan! You hung up on me! Later! Right now we have vampire nurses to deal with. Vampire nurses? All right. That's worth running for. Wait. Where's Rory and Erica? We figured out they were planning to rob the blood truck. Okay. Okay. Rory's on the move. And fast. He's either flying or... Oh, he's on that truck. And Erica's probably still with him. They're in danger. Vampires are super territorial. We gotta grab our gear and go after them. Fast. How is this door so strong? Looks like we're trapped alone. Together, just the two of us, for who knows how long. Are you seriously enjoying this? Well, let's see. You, me, a tight space filled with primo plasma? Hex, yeah, I'm enjoying this. Have you ever noticed how it... 
romantic comedies. The guy and girl start off fighting, then things change between them, and they end up sucking face by the end credits. Let's say we just skip to the end, baby. Somebody get me a wooden stake! Look what I found. These blood-sucking nurses have over 30 towns in the route. They've been running this scam for years. But it wouldn't run much longer if everyone knew there weren't real nurses. We can use that info against them. You mean, like, to bore them to death? Could work. Anyway, we gotta go now. Roy and Eric are in trouble. And I think Sarah's downstairs eating all of your frozen meat. I'm so tired of playing it safe. Why can't we have a little fun with these two? You know the rules. We have to take them to the council. The council? They don't need to know. It's not like these two noobs would put up much of a fight anyway. Maybe they won't. But we will. You? Yeah, that's right. Us. Yeah, and me. Too. I'm... I'm Benny. We met earlier. I'm the one who didn't pass out. Benny, get to Roy and Erica. Sarah and I hold them off. Mostly Sarah. <laughs> One blast of holy water, and it's all over. You're not a real vampire yet. By the way, you smell like junk food. Can I catch my breath? You are so dead! <sighs> What now, fledgling? Good thing one of us is an expert with advanced electronic... Ah! Ah! What is that? Is that your blood? Yeah. That's all you're gonna get. Mm, you don't know what you're full of, do you? Hmm. And he's had some ideas about that. Your blood is H deficient. One in a million. A single pint is worth more than everything in that truck. How about a trade? One pint of my blood in exchange for my friends. And you leave Whitechapel forever. Why bargain when we can just take it? Done. What? Annie, why must you do everything the hard way? If you let me up, I'll get to work. Yeah, and I'll give you all my computer passwords, too. No. If my blood's coming out, Sarah does the job. I trust her. I don't know what it is, because I barely eat anymore, but I'm even gassier as a vampire. It was so bad that my mom tried Shut up! What would it take to shut you up? I will do anything. Huh? Okay, it's okay. You know, I know it's hard, but you just have to... Done. Now take it and get out of here. Hmm. You're a walking blood bank, kid. What's stopping us from making more withdrawals? This, for one thing. One click, and I email the details of your little scam to every school in a thousand-mile radius. No one's gonna roll out the blood red carpet for you again. Behold. Power. Technology. Doris, open this. This isn't what it looks like. He wouldn't shut up. Kissing him actually seemed less annoying. Ugh. I am surrounded by vampire noobs. Let's get out of here. You two need a ride home? No! We're good. It's nice out. And uh, we could use the flight prac 
practice. Ow! What was that for? You know, something tells me Rory wasn't trying too hard to open that door. Doris openness? Stupidest doofuses? Come on, we could make a fortune selling your blood to vampires. Uh -uh. No more needles. Not ever. You can cast a fear reversal spell. No thanks. I value my life. Turn one goldfish inside out, and all of a sudden you're Lord Voldemort. Hey, Sarah. No chips today. Yeah, the whole bloodlust thing was intense, but we're all good now that the blood drive's over. You still smell good to me. Gee, thanks. <laughs> So do you. I must feel sad that Erica went home empty-handed. Mm, somehow I doubt she'll go hungry for long. <sighs> Come to mama. Come on, let me in.